What up? Chia, 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 it's your boy, Anthony. Yo, so I'm going to go quick with this one. Uh, this is just some, some tips. Um, R35 GTR. This was my story car. So basically, this is what I chose for, to beat the 2 boss. Um, it doesn't have any stars, as you can see. Um, but what I want to show you guys is some tips for upgrading. What I did with this one was uh, I just upgraded it. It's, it has all upgrades, no fusion parts. Um, and the reason why I'm doing that is because I have a duplicate um, R35 that I won from crates. And so I use this car for like any challenges that are like in-game challenges. So like if I need a tuning challenge or to gain some keys. And the reason why I do that and don't put fusion parts is because I think it's good to have one car for those like challenges and then one car for live racing that you keep tuned. So you're not down going back and forth on your tunes. You just have one car that does one thing and your other car to do the other thing. I feel like live racing that um it's good to have the fusion parts on that one because on you know your battles on a daily basis those are just you know maxed out cards pretty much uh, just having the upgrades to make that work so let's go ahead and gain these keys for today just to show you why i do it because the car is still super fast i don't need any fusion or tuning on it um in order to win these keys um it's on this last race so let's go ahead and do that and then i'll show you how tuning works and why it is beneficial to have if you have two cars that have one that's just for live racing and one for tuning trials. So we're going to go ahead and I think I have one race left. Yep. Win these 25 silver keys. The trick with the R35 is you have to tap, tap, tap on the takeoff because it you don't want to hit the wall. The rev meter is going to hit that wall and it's going to slow you down a ton. So you're pretty much just like tap, 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 tap and then hitting the NOS at the same time at some point and just in the hopes that it just you know you make it through without hitting that wall so let's see what's going on let's get this knocked out let's get these keys so i drop her on one all right so obviously it's not even close so like i said you know this car has all upgrades no fusion parts so we just won the keys thank you very much i love the key trials usually this car runs like a seven Eight seven three seven seven. I mean seven 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 three. Um, so thank you for the key. appreciate that. All right, so let's go check out the the tuned one. Um, actually, you know what? I'll show you the upgrades on this, so as you, you guys can see that you know there's no um, fusion parts and different things going on um, since we're on it anyways. Um, but yeah, I think the lobbies are set up from zero to nine. So when you build a car for live racing and you're only doing live racing, if you're gonna bet, make sure you got a nine on that. Um, on the end or that you have high Evo Evo is the plus so let's go over that real fast you see the t4 right below the GTR that means that that is the tier tier 4 um, stage car 655 is performance parts that are installed on that bad boy which are upgraded so your upgrades are that with when people talk about PP and then Evo points are the points when you tune it of you see the plus three seven when I tuned it, that's how many points it gave me. So as you can see, this car has a few stage six upgrades. Um, I have stage five body, stage six tires, stage six transmission, stage five engine, stage six turbo, stage five intake, stage five NOS, and stage five body. All right, so let's go ahead and check out the tune on this. Um, it's, it's a simple tune, dude. Um, this should work for everybody um, if you had the same, say, six parts. Um, but like I said, I like to give you guys idea so you can see foundations and stuff. See, zero fusion parts, uh, 38 out of 42 upgrades. So that is good. Let's go ahead and check out the tune, and we'll see what it, the dyno looks like. The tune on this, uh, almost maxed. R5 is 150, 445. And 22 for the tires. So check out the dyno. This dyno's at 771 um, with those upgrades. And no, that is zero fusion parts, okay? All right, so let's hurry up and get on over to the tuned R35. I'm going to show you guys the reason why I believe zero to nine is the way it works. Um, I'm going to show you guys my 559 uh, R35. And then see what, I'm going to show you what lobby it puts me in. It's going to put me in. And I have um, a ton of like Mustangs, Stingrays, Tier 3 cars. 
And so that's why, you know, I know I have a, a t Lobby Tune 559 Camaro, and it's the same cars. And I always see these R35 fire, and they just smoke me. So I'm gonna show you guys what the dyno on this bad boy is before we go in there. Um, I don't think anybody will race me, um, but we can go in there and try, see what happens. All right, so dyno on this is 8.220, wow, for a quarter mile. So yeah, that is fast. So we have 67, final drive is five. Tire pressure is zero, zero. zero. All right, so let's head out out of here. I'll show you the upgrades. I just add fusion parts to these upgrades, so it depends on what fusion parts you have in order to make that happen. All right, so upgrade for this tune, 559 Lobby R35. Oh yeah! All right, so we have zero, zero on the body. We have stage four on the tires, stage five transmission, stage zero on the engine zero on a turbo and we have stage four it looks like nope nope it's not stage four what stage are we on this bad boy stage zero on an intake the nos it's only stage two um which is bananas all right so let's head on let's see how many fusion parts i have on this You'll probably have more fusion parts. Um, just add them, man. If if you can upgrade a car all the way and add the fusion parts and then downgrade and with a tune, that's the best bet because basically you want to see what that does. So as you can see, my performance parts come out to 559. My Evo's 940. I only have 18 fusion parts. Let's head on over into live racing. See if anybody will race this. I know I avoid R35s when I go into the tier three lobby, uh, only because it's just not fair. It really isn't. And this is pretty much, you know, if you're playing newbies, you know, noobs that are learning the game, um, people that have been playing for a while will understand um, that this is just, you don't race R35s. It's just plain and simple. All right, so we're looking for races. Let's see if we can get somebody to race this. Booyah, booyah, booyah. Let's see, R35, see, T4, T4s, you see the T3s, you see the T3s, I told you, all right, so another R35, so like I said, they probably got the same tune um, up in here and just smoking these cars, watch this, I'm trying to race this BMW, he's going to say, no way, I ain't racing you, you're going to take all my money, it's not even a fair race, let's see what happens, nope, exactly, my point, exactly. I like to make this up and beat all those stingrays that have these sick tunes. I'll, I'll do a stingray, uh, show you my stingray tune on the next one. But let's see what we got going on. Let's see if this guy, I don't think he's a sucker. If this guy doesn't accept, I'm just going to cash out. Yeah, let's get on out of here. All right. So obviously, like I said, you know, people know how fast this is. Um, I'll try this last guy real quick because I'd love to show you guys. But like I said, dude, let's see if this Stingray will run. What up, Stingray? These guys be killing the T3 lobby too. And it's a T3. I do suggest you get one if you can. If you get a, one with a star, that's even better. All right, so like I said, no one's gonna run not even, not even in competition. All right, guys, so if you guys have any questions or, or comment below, other than that, um, please subscribe. I'm going to have a contest soon for my subscribers only. Give away a gift card. I'm out. You guys take care. And we'll see you again soon.